Okay, guys. Let's see the first groups of the pictures. Which one do you prefer, the younger one or the older one? And let's see the second groups of the pictures. There are dark circles under the eyes. Do you notice that? Too much cortisol can break down skin collagen, and without enough sleep, your body releases less growth hormone. Yes, that is the light sleep may have an effect on us. So, what do you think? You've decided that you need more sleep, and that getting to bed earlier is the way to go. I'm helping you to prepare the body and the mind so that you can accomplish your goal of getting to sleep early, and wake up feeling well rested. Maybe you just do like the following way: have a plan to reach your starting much earlier to go to bed. Drink some hot black tea and get a good book to read, hoping you can be sleepy drifting to off to bed. Try to find an average time you need to this ratio. Then on the next day, go to bed for the same ratio 30 minutes earlier. Do this until you reach the time you want to actually fall asleep. Come off it. Drinking too much can lead to the toilet. Reading a story can lead to the pilot, and let you dream. How could you know the exact time you fall asleep? So there is another way for you. Let's see. This menu can be divided into four parts. Part one: deciding when to go to bed. Early and late are relative terms when describing sleep times. Much depends on when you need to or are able to wake up each day, and how much sleep you are getting. There is some variation from people to people, but generally adults need 7.5 to 8.5 hours of sleep per day. Pick a good bedtime. Choose a bedtime that is early enough for you to get the right amount of sleep, according to your age and schedule. Recognize that inadequate sleep can be unhealthy. Just acknowledging the importance of your sleep needs can help you to start to improve your situation. If you have to put an all-nighter for school or work, clear your schedule the next day so that you can be able to concentrate solely on these tips for going to bed early. You will need to recover from the lack of sleep. Part two: Preparing for sleep during the day. Avoid stimulants if you're trying to go to sleep early. Avoid coffee and other caffeinated products and other stimulants. Their effects can last for hours, making it hard to go to sleep when you want to. Don't eat too much at night. Your last meal should be no less than two to three hours before your bedtime. If you eat a big meal close to bedtime, it can make it hard to go to sleep and stay asleep. Avoid exercising too close to bedtime. Limit naps. Naps can help if you are tired, but you should avoid long naps and naps near your bedtime. Monitor your lighting conditions, particularly late in the day. Get plenty of the natural light in the morning and during the day. Then keep the lights dim at night. Part three: Establishing the right environment for sleep. Establish a sleep routine. Get your body and your mind used to going to sleep early by doing the same things each night before you go to sleep. Do whatever relaxes you. Read a book, take a bath or shower, listen to relaxing music, and so on. Some people find it helpful to use it to lessen outside distractions, like earplugs or the white noise of a small phone or other device. Go to bed when you feel tired. If you feel tired, it means you should go to bed. Don't force yourself to stay awake. On the other hand, if you are not tired, do not try to force yourself to sleep. Part four: Making an early bedtime a habit. Make your bedtime consistent. Going to bed at the same time every night will improve your sleep and make it easier to go to sleep early. Don't expect a huge change right away. If you're trying to shift your sleep schedule to an early time, don't expect to easily make a drastic change in one night. Try making change step by step. For instance, if you have been going to sleep at 11 o'clock. And decided that you want an early bedtime of 10 o'clock. Don't expect to jump back the whole hour on the first night. Instead, try going to bed for a few nights at 10:45, then a few at 10:30, and a few at 10 o'clock, before hitting your goal of 10 o'clock. That's all. I'm Henry Lee. Thanks for watching, and I wish you a happy early sleeping.